Okay people, here we go again. I have got a ton of Funko boxes to unbox for you. What you're seeing here right now is not even half of them. I've got even more boxes on the floor that I couldn't fit on camera, okay? So come on, let's do this. Oh, and by the way, I'm just showing you the top of this pile. Yeah, so, and there's even more on the floor, like I just said. So, let's do this. Welcome to Mike's Second Toys. Welcome to Mike. Welcome to Mike's Second Toys. Oh, cool. So, this is the one where you get not only the Funko Pop, but a t shirt. Nice. Look, there's a bit of damage there on that. And as you know, as I keep saying, oh look, there's damage there too. As a collector, the box means everything. So this is going back and I'll get a replacement. I don't mess around with Amazon, you know. They're a big enough and rich enough company, okay? So I have no issue sending this back and getting a replacement. Michonne! Ah, Stan Lee, rest in peace. Ah, right now, you see what I was saying earlier on? You may recall that I have, in one of my previous huge Funko Pop unboxings, I already unboxed this particular Superman number 207. If you're wondering why am I unboxing it again, or why did I get it again, well, after the video, I noticed there was damage on the box, so I sent it back and got a replacement. So yeah, here is Superman again, that pose. Now, that is different to the one I just opened a couple of minutes ago. Where is it? Down there. There you go, look, that one there is the DC Superheroes 07 and it happens to be a Chase Limited Edition and this one right here is a DC Justice League 207 Superman. Ah, nice, 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 nice. Now, Remember the previous unboxing, that Batman and Robin 281 edition? Well, I also went for the, and I love these ones with the scenes and everything. Yeah, I went for the Batman and Commissioner Gordon 291 edition. I love these movie moments. Yeah, they're called movie moments where they have scenery and everything. And if you're wondering uh, what's happened to the lighting in here, well, I dimmed it, okay? Because this bad boy, if you look here, it says, try me, the bat light actually works. How awesome is that? 
<laughs> and what I like about it too, it doesn't just stay on and kill your battery. So you press it, it comes on, and then it will turn off like that. Absolutely awesome. Loving the box too, look. <laughs> Okay, so that's that lot. Let's keep going. Oh, ho, ho. I've been waiting for this one. Oh, nice. Comes in its own additional cardboard Funko box. Oh, cool. This is the first order. Flame Trooper. I'll keep this additional box and here it is very nice Damaged box. Ah yes, replacement Knight Rider. <laughs> the first one I got yesterday, damaged. Nice. This is awesome! First order, three pack. And what I like about this, they're not just three figures put in one box. Each figure has its own Funko Pop box. Nice! Black Panther in gold. Wow. It's the dock at the clock tower. This is awesome. Now, as you can see, I have cleared the deck because I need all the room I can get because yes, ha, I haven't finished all the unboxings just yet. There's a couple more boxes down there. I needed space for this massive Funko Pop. <laughs> yes, look, it's one of those little mini Funko Pops and 
just to show you, look, it's got Funko on the top there. But yeah, let's continue with the regular size Funko Pops. So there you go people, the collection continues to grow, that was my biggest haul so far. Thanks for watching, catch me next time on Mike's Second Toys plus Movie Memorabilia.